Mayo County Council provides its extensive range of services to the county from offices in nine towns in Mayo. Orison Kunde in Castlebar is the head office for the council and provides a broad range of services including planning, motor tax, waste management and cultural affairs to the community. Unlike, let's say, a new build scenario where in the very recent past we would have done new civic projects like Casper Courthouse or Bell Mullet Civic Centre, where we would have, uh, from day one, designed in the uh, accessibility requirements on paper. However, when we come to a building that is a functioning building, it, it's very much more a different problem in that we have to work around the staff, which is in excess of 300 in the building, we have to work around them uh, in, in, in upgrading the building and um, of course with the building of 18 years of age um, the structure of it independent of the staff has to be modified so things simple things like door widths um, a great deal of work has to go into widening uh, things like door widths but in the end I think that we've um, come up with a, a considerable improvement in the building which I think provides a far greater service and facility for not only the staff but obviously for the public as well. The physical changes that we have made to the building, the alterations that have been made, benefit everybody, not just people with disabilities. Um, people who don't have disabilities are using the same facilities and find them so much easier to use. By consulting properly with the users or people with, people with disabilities, um, we find out um, what their actual needs are as opposed to our perception of what their needs are. The process involves a lot more than just the physical infrastructure. We must look at our service provision as well and how we provide it. We also must look at our IT, our website. So all the changes that we have made have a much more global impact for the organisation at large. So the greatest reward I think from all of the work has been the awareness, of the new awareness of, of all of the staff. Uh, and I think that they have a greater appreciation of the requirement for disability access and um, every other aspect of, of which we need to provide uh, for accessibility in general. <laughs>